Deftones, Knife Party, POV, Point of View, Guitar Tabs, and Guitar Lesson. Okay, so this is White Pony, so we're drop C tuning. So we'll have the C, G, C, F, A, D. All right, and uh, this song is a lot about just kind of a real specific strumming pattern, I guess. So um, the initial chord that we want, we're going to be here at the third fret. And we'll do the th third fret on the low C and the G, the sixth and the fifth string here. And then we'll just do fives on the fourth, third, and second string there. And with this, it's basically we go one, a slight hesitation, one, two, three, four, five, little hesitation, one, two, three, four, five, hesitate again, one, two, all right, and then we zoom it up to and go through that a couple times. Then we take it up here, we go seventh fret on the, the low C and the G, the six and five string here, do a nine on the middle D, so we get that sus two vibe, and it's kind of the same strum style here. We go once, hesitate, one, two, three, four, five, hesitate again, one, two, three, four, five. Then we make that nine on the uh, fourth string there, a 10, and then we go one, two, three, four, five, back to the nine for one, hesitate there, and then finish with one, two, three, four strums. All right, so just trying it slowly here. And now we kick on some overdrive, get a little bigger with it. And it's essentially the same deal, the same chords, but we just switch the strumming a little bit. We kind of lessen it. All right, we go more of a, a same chord, just threes with the fives. And we go one, two, three, hesitate, one, two, repeat that twice. And then we take it up to our sevens with the nine, one, two, three, hold it. Make the 10 on the fourth string, keep the sevens here. One, two, three, hold that for just a moment. Back to the nine, hit that once and then do a little hesitation there and then once a uh, couple more times there. So we'll try this slowly here. For the chorus, uh, kind of a similar strumming pattern to the, the previous section, um, but new chords here. Uh, we take it up to the eighth fret here. All right, just do eights on the, the low C, the G, and the middle C, the six, five, four string. And like I said, similar strumming pattern, just one, two, three, hold, one, two, three, hold. But then we jump down to this chord here. This is kind of like the change in the House of Flies chord here. It's the open low C with the, the eight, on the fifth string, um, just kind of mute the the fourth string here just by kind of lightly having your finger touch it there. And then we have the, the 10 on the third string here. All right, and with this, it's uh, strum that, the open eight, 10, one, two, and then drop down to seven and nine, keeping that open low C once there. So one, two, three, all right, and then we hold for a moment and then we go, Another strum on that with the seven and nine in the open, back up to the eight and 10 with the open, back to the seven and nine with the open. So slowly. And for the bridge, uh, pretty straightforward here. Um, we do a chord we've seen, but we start on this where we do the seven on the sixth and fifth string with the 10 on the fourth string. And with this, initially, we just give it a single strum and just let it ring. This is kind of where like the, the crazy background vocals start coming in and all that jazz. So hit that, let it ring. All right. And then we just switch to our change in the House of Flies chord, the open C eight on the fifth string, 10 on the third string, and then hit that, let it ring. And after we do that a handful of times, uh, then we just kind of like do the same chords, but we're doing more of that similar like uh, chorus style strumming where we're going one, two, three, one, two, three, and then switch the chord one, two, three, one, two, three. <laughs> 